Howdy, lieutenants and economists. The most volatile, evil, disgusting things on the planet, humans. If you have a video request, you can always go to assholeconsulting.com. Yeah, I am gonna charge you, kids. And that is the importance of not fucking up. You are such an asshole! Double clarity test today. Good evening, Mr. Clary. I'm going by the name Miles. I don't care what name you guys go through. I don't care. I'm interested in requesting a double clarity test on two presidential runner-ups, John McClain, McCain and John Kerry. Do you think this would be an inappropriate time since McCain just recently passed away? No, no. It's never, it's never too early. Never too early. Let's go through John McCain. I think I did McCain one time, and he came from wealth, but he was in the military... And then he was a professional career politician. God, that guy just, him and Pelosi and the other aged broad who's 85. And, oh, what is her name? <clears throat> She's in California. It's like, God, go away. John Sidney McCain III. Well, American politician and military officer served as senator from 1987. God almighty. Jesus Christ. He gets a point right there because <clears throat> the guy was a career politician. Point against him because what did he do? What is he doing now? All he did was that. He does have real world work experience going into the military. I know that. Uh, let's go to the his uh, early life and education. Born in a naval, Panama Canal, a naval officer, John S. McCain and Roberta Wright. He had an older sister, Sandy, younger brother, Joe. At the time, Panama Canal was under U.S. control. McCain's family tree includes Scottish, Irish, English, Sandy, blah, blah, blah. I don't care where. Also, Naval Academy graduates became four-star Navy admirals. Okay, he came from wealth. Point against him. Private preparatory school. Oh, yeah. He excelled at wrestling. You know another guy who's dead who excelled at wrestling? Paul Wellstone. He's dead now. Headstone. <laughs> uh, I referred to bed up. Uh, Fallen to stoops. He entered the Naval Academy. But uh, sometimes a kind of lightweight boxer. Good for him. Uh, he was a pilot. Got shot down. Prisoner of war. So he does uh, get a real uh, no point there. So what did he study? Did he go into the Navy? Um... Went to the Naval Academy. All right. So he did. He did not major in something stupid. So he came from wealth. Didn't major in something stupid. Has real world working experience. But what is he doing now? He just became a career politician. He gets a two. Uh, would I have liked to have a uh, beer with him? No. Uh, should he have ran for office? No. Um, I just. I just have no... The guy, you know, the, the the first real experience he had was getting his ass shot down. That was the first real experience he had. It was a horrible experience. You know, you'd like to have something a little bit more in between, like having to work the late shift for a year and a half, that might be. But, no, yeah, he, he got woke. Apparently not then. I'm going to become a senator and run for president. Dirty nerd. Um, so, no, I would not want to have a beer with him. And I do not... I think he's a traitor, frankly. He's just a traitor. Um, he was all about himself. All right, let's do John Kerry. John Kerry, I know, married into wealth. He also served in Vietnam, so he does have real-world working experience. So I know there's that. Oh, he's from Aurora. I didn't know that. <clears throat> uh, is he still... Did he retire... Is he still in office? In office. He retired a year and a half ago. Member of the Democrat Party, served as U.S. Senator from 1985. God almighty, fuck off a point right there. Born in Aurora, attended boarding school, graduated from Yale, major in political, worthless degree, <clears throat> probably came from wealth. Let's go where his early life is. Born uh, medical center, second of four children, foreign service officer and lawyer, a nurse and social activist. His father is captive. Oh, John Richard John Kerry, Jewish immigrants turned Episcopal. Who's John? He's always got his own entry. Career. 
career, Air Corps, World War II, test pilot. His dad's badass. Dad is badass. Diplomat in the United States, and he also served as a lawyer for the Bureau of the United Nations. Yeah, so he, he, he came from wealth. Okay, so John Kerry came from wealth, majored in worthless crap. But I, if you're going to major in political science, went to Yale. Yeah, like he's partying with uh, with John F. Kennedy. It's <laughs> a picture of, fuck you. Just fu and then he married, then he married into wealth. He married some gal. Where is, uh... Returned from Vietnam, early political career. He was it, it ran for politics in 1972. This douchebag had no intention of working a real job. Uh, came from well, he did, that's the uh, yeah. He does have real world working experience being in the military. Where did he marry the rich broad? Where is he married? Who is he married to? God, look at this. You know, went to Yale. Oh. Ooh. Spouse, Julia, uh, Teresa Heinz, that's it, Teresa Heinz. The Heinz ketchup thing. What's their net worth? One billion dollars in 2008, which is probably tripled now with asset prices going up. Okay, <clears throat> so this one's straight. Uh, do I want to have a beer with him? No. Should he run for office? No. He's, he's the epitome of people who should not run for office. This guy had no intention of ever running for, uh, working a real job right out of Vietnam, wants to run for office. Just, ugh, disgusting. So, uh, that's it. There you go. Guys, questions, answers. Assholeconsulting.com, America's older brother. Kick your ass when you don't need your ass kissed. Blah, 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 booty, booty, B. Take a look at the new book, Love Letters to Leftists, coming out relatively soon. We'll see y'all later. Toodles.